What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Chicago White Sox versus New York Mets Major League Baseball matchup going down Friday, August 30th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between the Chicago White Sox and the New York Mets. The Chicago White Sox setting up Jonathan Cannon for the start in this one, while the New York Mets will counter with Tyler McGill. And Cannon has not been great in his last three starts. He's given up a combined 13 runs over 14 and two-thirds innings of work, has had four strikeouts in each of those three starts, and uh, he's given up five runs in back-to-back -back outings. So he has really had some issues as of late. But I will say, he still, for me, is one of the better options that the, the White Sox still have in that rotation alongside Garrett Prochet. We'll have to see if this is a team that's going to build for the future, if they're going to just be in a rebuild for the next few years. We'll have to see. But I still think Cannon can be somewhat competitive here. The New York Mets, yes, this is a team that's fired themselves back into the wild card hunt in the National League. You know, they've been battling up to this point in the year. You look at the wild card standings at the time this video is being recorded. They're only three and a half games back of the Atlanta Braves for the final wild card spot and a strong showing in this series. And the Braves having a tough matchup against the Phillies this weekend could, you know, put the Mets or give the Mets the chance to put some real pressure on the Atlanta Braves or even the Padres and Diamondbacks who are in that wild card mix as well in the National League. You know, the Mets can can uh, can sneak up on them. But the thing for me here is that Tyler McGill on the other side is not the starter I'm really rushing to back and, you know, hoping to back if I'm if I'm the New York Mets or if I'm a fan backing the New York Mets. Maybe this is a good get right spot for McGill because he definitely needs one after his last three starts. He's allowed 14 runs over his last 14 or third innings of work, has faced a couple tough oppositions in there. You know, he faced Atlanta and Houston at home, gave up four runs in each of those two starts, making it into the sixth inning. Also gave up six runs on three hits against the Chicago Cubs. But keep in mind, all three of those starts came in late June and late July. He made a spot start. But since then, we haven't seen Tyler McGill since July 27th. So there could be some rust here. And that could be a spot for the White Sox to sneak in and take advantage the bottom line for me is that this is just a hefty price for the Mets just because it's the White Sox on the other side. And I think you're still going to be getting some value with the White Sox plus the run and a half. We saw it a lot of the season against the Texas Rangers where the White Sox battled. They covered five of those seven games on the run line. I know the Texas Rangers are having a down year, but the White Sox have been a lot more competitive in some of their recent games. And I think that they can compete here. I just think that this is a, you know, a high pressure game for New York. But I think the White Sox, you know, are, are starting to show a little bit of fight. I think they're trying to avoid having that uh, that dubious distinction of having the worst record in Major League history. So I'm going to take a shot on the White Sox here, plus the run and a half. Like I said, I'm just not loving this price with the Mets, but I'll take the White Sox plus the run and a half here, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. Why are your pick dogs? Check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.